Hi guys, welcome back to Enigma Inc. This is your Psychic Intuitive Tarot Reader. So from today onwards we are going to do the readings for the month of June 2020. So this is going to be in English followed by Hindi for each sign on regular basis. So this is general reading. Take what resonates and leave what doesn't. For personal readings you can always contact me through the description given below and do not forget to follow me on Instagram for regular updates and latest offers. So let's begin without wasting our time. Let's do this for Pisces please. What's coming up in June 2020 for my Pisces? Alright. Okay Pisces. Some of you could be dealing with a Scorpio or a Virgo or a Virgo. This person is quite secretive, they're, they're hiding their true feelings or they're showing themselves. They're, they're behaving very moody with you, I feel that. With a strength card, yes, they... Okay, Pisces. So I feel that... Hmm. Let me see more. So whoever you're dealing with is someone from your friend circle, someone who could be a mutual friend. Okay, so they're interested in you. All right, but the connection is just the beginnings, in, in the beginning stages, and they feel that you can tame them. So whoever you're dealing with could be another water sign, Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer, or could be a Leo that you're dealing with. So whoever this person is, there's some sort of sort of strong attraction this is not even just attraction it is between emotional you know development emotional attachment at the same time attraction physical attraction so this person whoever you're dealing with is not very consistent with their feelings towards you but yes this is just the beginning stages and they want to know more about you whoever you're dealing with I feel that there's quite on and off energy between you guys with the high priestess. Someone over here is hiding their true face, true feelings. They might be actually not showing you how they actually feel. All right, they might be cold outside while they have feelings inside or it can be a vice versa situation. They might be cold outside, cold inside and they might not like you. But they show that they like you. So it's kind of on and off energy. Their energy keeps on switching from uh, liking you at one time and then not liking you at the other time. So they might be very moody. Whoever you're dealing with is a very moody person. Someone over here is a terror reader or a psychic or a teacher or a professor or a doctor or a veterinarian. Okay. So yeah, in June, I feel that the connection is going to develop. This person is going to open up, you know, they, this person is going to communicate towards you. They might have been uh, very, um, you know, they're trying to, they had been trying to control their desire to talk and come towards you. They might have not reciprocated your feelings. Maybe you came towards them and they might not have reciprocated you the way you did. And now they want to open up. Now they feel like talking to you. They feel like communicating with you. They're developing something. They're developing. They're missing you. And they're feeling like they want to talk to you. So some sort of emotional feeling is developing in this person. But yes, there is an involvement of a third party with three of cups and three of swords. I feel that there is an involvement of a third party over here. Maybe the person you're dealing with is already committed to someone else or might be looking around for some new person. Or it's you who could be like who, who might have given up on this person and have decided to move on with a new person. So I feel that with you, I feel that you have many options. Yes. And with this person, this person is missing you and they want to feel the connection with you again. So they had been waiting for you to talk to them again or to, you know, you know, to communicate, they might come up towards you to communicate. But I feel that they sense that you have left it, left the situation to die and you have moved on because you feel that nothing is coming out of this connection because they are not showing your true feelings. They are not opening up. Okay, they are being too secretive. They are being too much into their own energy. So, yes, I feel that 
they had that power to tame you or you have had the power to tame this person whoever you had been dealing with so there's a strong sense of uh, not just physical attraction not love but somewhere in between somewhere in the beginning all right so i feel that so this person had been waiting a lot had been waiting for you to talk to you to, uh, for you to you know move towards them to talk to you okay so they had been waiting that you go and talk to this person but uh, i feel that you retreated from this situation you you let the situation to die and you moved on you might have separated from this person whoever this person is you could have been dealing with a libra gemini or an aquarius you could have been dealing with a aries uh, aries sag leo okay libra uh okay virgo taurus capricorn okay so whatever the situation is i feel that you try to disconnect with this person completely or they might have disconnected uh, you know uh, themselves for a while to actually realize how they actually feel because this is a lockdown period and i feel that this person whoever you're dealing with is trying to spiritually awaken themselves by looking into what suits them or what they like or what they want to go for or what they don't want to go for and they might be working on opening up themselves more okay so this could be a scorpio that you have been dealing with so right now they're retreating they're into their own lockdown energy and they might come up and they have been waiting for you to even go towards them and make a conversation again so they might have been waiting for you to make a conversation they might have been watching on social media so they might ask for forgiveness or you might have heard them and they want you to uh come and ask for uh, forgiveness so that can that could be a reason but with this i feel that there's an overall energy the fact that this person has been missing you actually this person is actually missing you okay what else Pisces so with this uh, cards that I got the last card that I get is that uh, what do you need to release so this is the person that you need to release because they are not the one they're meant for you all right and they realize this thing they do realize this thing that is why they're controlling their emotions to open up so I feel that you need to release the situation because nothing is going to come out of this situation and uh, yes there is a sense of third party involvement so there's not going to be any sort of commitment for for the current uh, time i feel that the current energy says that there's not, not going to be a commitment with this person but yes you might have options and there is a fated connection with this person this person came into your life to teach you something so there was some uh, understanding about life when you met this person so there was some spiritual awakening happening in your life after you met this person so you guys were fated to meet each other so yes it could be a karmic connection but you guys were fated to meet each other to teach each other something okay and grow out of it so that you can go towards the next phase of your life let's see more okay so listen okay joy and stability so i feel that uh, you might be getting more in tune to your spiritual powers you might be getting more in tune to your psychic energy or intuition so you're listening to your gut feeling you're realizing that what is not actually working for you you're not holding on to something that is not actually working for you you're learning to move on you're learning to let go of situation because you're in tune with your intuition you're listening to your inner inner voice okay and so this is this has brought a lot of stability and joy in your own life because you're you're actually spending more time with the people who care about you rather than focusing on those who are not caring about you so this is the current energy i feel for you pisces so i feel that overall you're enjoying and you have many options and this person has been missing you lately so that's it guys i hope you liked it do not forget to like subscribe share it with your friends and hit the bell icon for future posts till then bye bye thank you for watching